Now, in the book of 1 Samuel chapter 14, from verse 24 to 34. Now the Israelites were in distress that day, because so had bound the people under an oath, saying, Curses be anyone who eats food before evening comes, before I have avenged myself and my enemies. So none of the troops tasted food. The entire army entered the woods, and there was honey on the ground. When they went into the woods, they saw the honey coming out, yet no one put his hand to his mouth, because they feared the oath. But Jonathan had not heard that his father had bound the people with the oath. So he reaches out the end of the staff that was in his hand and dipped it into the honeycomb. He raises his hand to his mouth and his eyes brighten. Then one of his soldiers told him, Your father bound the army under a strict oath, saying, Curses be anyone who eats food today. That is why the men are faint. Jonathan said, My father had made trouble for the country, and see how my eyes brightening when I taste a little of this honey. How much better it would have been if the men had eaten today some of the plunder they took from their enemies. Would not the slaughter of the Philistines have been even greater? That day after the Israelites had struck down the Philistines from Milkmash to Achalon, they were exhausted. They pounced on the plunder, and taking sheep, cattle, and cows, they butchered them on the ground, and ate them together with the blood. Then someone said to Saul, Look, the men are sinning against the Lord by eating meat that have blood in it.